three seconds on this, three seconds on that. Hey guys, it's me, Christina Marie. I am curling my hair for you guys today. I'm testing out some products. This is a three in one curling iron. And this bad boy is uh, just one, but I'm actually gonna be putting these to the test. These are not like your typical curling irons. So you guys know these are the old school curling irons where you have the handle right here. These are not, they send you a glove in the box and you are supposed to hold the hair and curl it this way. It's supposed to give you more of a natural end to the hair. Now, Davoli did send me these in the mail Yes, they did. They sent me this in the mail. Um, but they also know just because you send it to me doesn't mean that you're going to get a good review. I'm going to give you my honest opinion. I'm going to test these bad boys out. This is my first time, believe it or not, actually testing out these newer type of curling irons. They sent it to me. They know I do hair professionally. So I was like, send it to me. I want to try it. <laughs> I'll play with it. But you might not like what I think. Anyways, so this is the first one they sent uh, in the smaller box, and I'm gonna curl. I'm gonna curl the three quarters of my hair on this side with this one. Three quarters of my hair on this side with this one. This is a ceramic three in one, and this is just one. They are a big price difference, I believe. So let's just stop rambling. Oh, before I stop rambling, let me show you guys the difference really quick. So the Davoli comes with many different sizes. These are the medium, the smaller, and the bigger one is the same exact size as that. So would you pay for this? Would you buy it? Is it is it worth it? I don't know. You guys let me know in the comment section down below. Hit that little subscribe down button while you're down there. But let me know in the comment section down below what you think. Give me your honest opinion. Don't hold back. Tell me the truth. Let's just jump to that video. Okay guys, so let's open up the first one. We're gonna open up this one first. Take off the plastic, unravel the cord. Let's see what it looks like. Huh, ah, okay, so it's ni nice, but the handle is very sticky. Now that's kind of weird. This is brand new and look like, you guys can see that which is look at that like it seems like it had hairspray or something on it but it's brand spanking new so that i do not like the handle feels very very sticky take off the stickers that it came on we're gonna go ahead and plug this sticky iron on in you guys can see right there that's how it sits on and go all the way up to the max setting. We got 430 degree. Well, I put 430 degrees. See, 430 degrees. So let's let that heat up and let's open this one now. This one's really, really cool looking. Look at that. So this one feels uh, this like this is much more upscale. It feels like that is none of that sticky residue. Like this is nice and matte and let's see how this sucker works. So that's locked. And uh, how do I unlock? Oh, you twist this thing right here. So you unlock and it comes right off. These are ceramic. You can feel that these are ceramic. This is nice. So I wanna do the same size on each side. So these look to be the same size or is it this? Look at this one. No, this see this one's too small. The nice thing is, look, it comes with different sizes. So this is one size. This is two size, second size, and this is the third size, which looks to be the same size. So I'm gonna plug this one back. I'm gonna pl put it back on, and then we are going to try it on the hair. I have to do the arrow to arrow, and then lock. Each box came with one of these gloves. So we are gonna put the glove on and try this sucker out. Go ahead and do the metal one on this side. I think it's ready because it turned blue. So it turns blue when it's ready. And I'm going to wrap my hair like this around it. See how it looks when we do one up and then see how it looks when we do one down. And I'm gonna pull it out. So this is what it looks like oh. 
and you do it up. <laughs> Which tells me we should do it down. Let's do that again. So we're gonna hold it down like this. We're gonna put the hair on the very top of it. And we're just gonna spiral it down. And yes, this glove you will definitely need because I can see my hand just kind of like going and hitting it. And then we're gonna release it. Yes, okay. Let's go to the next section. So we're gonna take it at the base, we're gonna wrap the hair like this. And we're gonna hold and pull the hair tightly against it. And then we're going to release. I'm going to push the, I'm going to move the camera down so you guys can see a little bit better. Okay, and you see how the ends stay out and they look very natural. So let's go ahead and try this side. I'm going to take it and I'm going to push it up like that, wrap it. And then twirl it up closer. This one's really hot. And then we're going to release. I think that's a big difference, guys. Wow, this one looks really tight. I don't know. Let's just continue because this one's kind of tight, but that one's for a long piece. Wow. So we have it here. We're going to wrap it. We're going to slide the hair up it. And then we're going to... Hold it with a lot of tension, and then we're going to release. Wow. I think this one's much tighter. But then again, we did process this twice, so let's just go to the next section. We do the same thing. We're going to wrap it, and then we're going to slide the hair onto the top of it. Roll it in a little bit so that curls all the way through. We're going to wrap it and hold it tight. We're going to go one, two, three, and release. Okay. Wrap tight, bring it to the base, pull it to the top, and we're going to hold it. We're going to go one, two, three, four, five, and release. Give me a little bit more time instead of the counting to three. Girls, right, we can see them. Let's go to this side and see. Is the ceramic superior? Wrap, push to the top and twist it in. And we're gonna one, go. And we're gonna go. Same thing with the other one. One, two, three. I figured I'd do three to three since the front section I only did to three. So let's see here. Are they different? These are the two front sections. Aren't they different? I think this one is still a tad bit tighter. Look at that. Three seconds on this, three seconds on that. Two, three, four, five. I brought you guys all the way down. What do you think? Do they look the same? Or do you think that one side is stronger curled than the other? Hey guys, so I have curled this side with the ceramic, this side with the metal. And what do you guys think? I know you guys watched the video. What do you honestly think? I'm going to pull the camera down a little bit so you guys can see the ends and everything. So do you think there's a huge difference? I'm going to run my fingers through and we're going to see what it looks like. 
You know, this is the first time me using a curling iron like this. And I really have to say that I like how the ends look. I like how it gives it that very natural look. Kind of like I did my hair, but I didn't do my hair. So we're going to break it up with our fingers. This is what I always do to my hair. Is there a huge difference? I really think that the ceramic is much stronger of a curl. Not saying that this side is not beautiful because we can see it's beautiful, but I think this is a stronger curl on this side. Might just be me. You guys let me know. Do you see a difference? Both of them performed very, very well, but I just prefer a ceramic over a, a metal because I think it's healthier. I know it's healthier for the hair, but there is a huge price difference. Obviously, both of them perform. Look at that. It looks really, really, really pretty, guys. So I would honestly say both of these curlers are awesome. I just personally prefer the ceramic over the metal, but it depends on everybody's price point. Now, I saved the top for last because I do want to try out these other two curling sizes and see what it does, what it looks like. That's a beautiful curl. I could imagine doing your whole head in this size curl. Wow. And look guys, I'm not getting little sections. I'm getting pretty darn big sections because I figured I would curl it the way that I normally do and I don't sit there and take the smallest sections. I grab big, big chunks. I personally think that the ceramic gives such a uh, more shine to the hair than, well, this is the section you're looking at. I think it gives more shine to the hair because you can really compare it to the strands below. And I think this, these ones with the ceramic look a lot more shinier. Wow. I am really loving this iron. So absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous, tight curls. Let's go ahead and take this off, turn it off and unlock it. And we're gonna pull this off and we are gonna go with the next size. And we're going to wrap and hold. Now I am pulling against it. I'm put like pulling up to make sure that it's tight, but holding that last strand and let's release <laughs> wow guys turn that off i'm gonna push you guys back so you can see the full effect of everything Okay, so that is, wow. I think it looks so beautiful to have multiple different size curls in your hair. Obviously, this is the medium one, this is the tighter one, and these are the bigger ones, like, wow. Let's go ahead and just run our fingers through and kind of make this a little bit bigger. Then, wow. super gorge like wow just gorgeous there's a huge difference in these curls i could do i'm going to use this for so many different hairstyles okay so this is the bottom that i was talking about though i still think this one's tighter but i know i keep repeating myself i think that this is a beautiful beautifully structured beautiful like just how it looks curling iron and the fact that i have three different sizes i am actually just blown away with how good how quick this heated up how good it is and just like the 
curls that it gives me are breathtakingly gorgeous. You know what, guys? Like, honestly, I love curling irons, okay? Like, I have so many different curling irons. Typically, I use, like, hot tools. Hot tools, because I do hair. And this, is, I do hair professionally. I am a professional cosmetologist, and this is breathtaking. With a curling iron, you can do it with this, similar with a regular curling iron, yes, but those ends, the way that they look with this, leaving them out just gives it just more of a natural feel. So it looks like, wow. It looks just like, wow. Like you can do the big one. This is the big one on the bottom and walk in and be like, yeah, I just woke up like this, you know? <laughs> or you could do the medium one and be like, yeah, I spent some time. My curls are beautiful and shiny and like, like on point. Or you could do the really super little tight one and be like, yeah, I'm a little extra today and I'm gonna I'm gonna rock this look. Because like I'm just like I'm in love with this curling iron. It is by Devoli. I will post the links down below. This one, the metal one, it did well. It performed those. I had a few little issues. Like I don't like how it's sticky for some reason on the handle there. But I think that if I had to choose between them, I would go with this because I get three in one. This did good. I just think that uh, this one did better. But I do prefer using a ceramic personally over, an, over a metal. But I know that it depends on everybody's budget, which one they can get. Both of these are really, really good. This one just is superior. I will post uh, Devoli's information down in the description box. Um, I appreciate them sending this to me to test out. And yes, I am blown away. I hope you guys are really impressed with how this performed. All the information will be down below. Check it out. I'm not getting paid anything for this video. They just wanted my honest opinion and I'm going to give it to you honestly. I love their spin brush and I love these curling irons. I don't love all the curling irons but I love these curling irons. Really, really amazing. Anyways, like I said, I'm not getting paid for this, just my honest opinion. I hope this uh, review helped you guys out and you actually check out their company if you're looking for a curling iron. Anyways, please give this video a thumbs up while you're down there. Um, give it a thumbs up, hit that little subscribe button and the tiny little bell next to it for notifications of new videos. I'm Christina Marie, I'm out.